Hello, everyone. Um, it's a pleasure to be here talking to the, the participants of Space Art Art event, the second edition. And in this presentation, uh, it was composed by me, Luisa Santos, Aisa Pallares, and also Caio Ribeiro. And we'll be talking about how does the development of academic rocket projects contribute to the establishment of future space colonies. Just a brief introduction for you. Uh, we will give into you uh, an overview about the launch centers and, and bases in future habitats in, on Moon and Mars. And we'll be presenting some ideas about how this, uh, how this will be important uh, for the future establishment uh, in space colonies. And also uh, to introduce you about the academic rock studies in Brazil, the case of Portugal rocket design. Just, just to have an idea, the Portugal rocket design is um, an outreach project of Federal University of Rio Grande do Norte. Uh, the team is composed by students and uh, the, the other presenters are from by a Portugal rocket designer, maybe you will, you will hear, uh, hear a PRD uh, during the presentation, but this is the same. And well, uh, they are really committed with the development of these academic rockets and also an educational purpose here in Brazil. And we'll be presenting about the idea of how to integrate uh, the, the idea of space exploration that we developed uh, in Habitat Marte, and how we integrate their students, their students on academic rockets with our research and to contribute uh, uh, with one, one big goal, one, one big purpose. Well, uh, reaching space, when we talk about uh, come back to the moon or even arrive on Mars, uh, there is no a way so don't talk about rockets. Uh, the current development of SpaceX and also Blue Origin are allowing us uh, a, a new uh, space era. And well, uh, thinking about the establishment of futures, uh, our future launch, launching pads on Moon and Mars, it's necessary to consider a lot of aspects that are really uh, important. Uh, for this establishment that we'll be covering uh, during this presentation. And uh, we have here just to present to you some concepts. The, the left side picture is uh, the Moon Base Alpha proposed by SpaceX um, for that will be allowing the, the Moon mining uh, expeditions and also um, the future missions of, uh, uh, of Artemis. Sorry, uh, that will be uh, that will be landing. That will be launching the first woman uh, to be arriving on Moon, and this will be this Moon base will be allowing future expeditions to Mars and to make easier uh, the the access to that to the Red Planet and uh, will be to achieve other other missions more uh, with more feasibility. Uh, well, uh, talking about space exploration, I believe that most of you already know Habitat Marte. And um, just to be really quick here, um, Habitat Marte is an analog space station that is committed with space exploration here in Brazil. We are located in um, the semi arid region, northeast region, uh, Brazilian region. And well, here we, we are trying to study how uh, the experiences on Earth can contribute to future uh, to, the to the establishment of future colonies on Moon and Mars also, and you can see in the left in the left picture uh, the the facility the whole facility we have here the auditorium uh, also the uh, the station the analog station also uh, our greenhouse, and in the right picture uh, just to present to you this was an AVA an extravehicular activity that we conducted on Cabo Peak Volcano, which is an area, uh, a kind of analog area that we have in the, the proximities of Habitat Marte, near of Habitat Marte. And it's really interesting to, to notice that similarity with like a future uh, established uh, the, the moon sur surface. 
So it, ha it allows a lot of uh, ideas of concepts and also have some analysis, how would be the future exploration of Moon and Mars too. Uh, and some projects that we are current uh, committed with the development. The first one is the, uh, besides Habitat Marti, uh, we have the idea, uh, which also was presented on, on the last uh, Habitat event, which we call LUGA, uh, that is Lunar Green Analog Habitat. This is a proposal made by Professor Julio uh, that consists on an on a establishment on an area near of Habitat Marti that will be developing um, another analog habitat, uh, smaller, to analyze the isolation aspects and also the sustainability in a small space. And uh, this area we are also thinking about use as a, a launch center uh, to support future launches of Potiguar rocket design in the, in the Habitat Mart area. And with that, we want to, to turn Habitat Mart as an aerospace complex here in Brazil. So we are not only going to be conducting the analog missions and the scientific experiment, experiments, but also we'll be able to motivate students in local communities with uh, our activities and also with the launching of rockets that is very interesting for, for the local community because many of them, many students, uh, never had this opportunity to, to see something like this. And with that, promoting space education and STEAM in, the, in our region here and also to the whole Brazil, allowing it to the whole Brazil. Thanks, David. So, uh, talking about uh, Portugal Rock Design and PRD, uh, this is a dashboard uh, our, uh, with the presidents, the vice presidents, project management, and director board. Uh, don't have here this new sit sector, a uh, sector of uh, education, but uh, uh, we we are very excited because it's a new complement. <laughs> Can I go to the next slide? Next slide. <laughs> so, talk about a uh, space project in, in your our. Um, in our, uh, we have uh, the electronics, aerodynamics, propulsion sectors, uh, stru structures, and recovery. Uh, our rock, uh, rock team, they do uh, academic rocks, but we compromise with with uh, our space education too. And uh, the form uh, we consolidated. Uh, by uh, technologies, uh, aerospace technologies, we uh, was uh, with the new launch pad for small rockets with the Habitat Map in uh, Caixara do Rio dos Ventos. Next slide, please. So, to do that, we need uh, uh, um, mission uh, safety rules and we uh, uh, choice the NAR, uh, National Rocketing Association, to uh, do uh, this mission safety guidelines. Uh, we of the uh, PRG uh, was uh, uh, go, going to uh, the Habitat Mart in the mission uh, 69 and uh, follow up this, this protocols, risk and availabilities of the projects, and the relevance of the locals. And uh, we uh, do this measurements of the local. Next slide, please. For uh, about of the measurements, the measurements we uh, look this static testing location, the problem, and the latent bed location. So 
to uh, uh, around of the uh, proportional risk assessment, we we are okay because our uh, small rocket have a, a project projected by uh, above the tre 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 30, <laughs> 33 on 100 uh, meters. So it's okay for us. And the leading pen location, uh, our type of the motor is the F. So for uh, in the uh, image uh, on direct, uh, right, we notice that that's okay. And the minimal diameter, a clear area, minimal personal distance and minimal distance co uh, for complex rockets, uh, that's okay for us in this location, the Luga, the probable local location for the doing the leading pad. Next slide, please. Uh, but we uh, identified two probably uh, point of risks and uh, do new measurements and notice that that's okay, that uh, enter the, the normal of the NAR and uh, we first it can be possible to encamiate the project. Like please. For that, uh, for all of the, the this things that I said, entire uh, lot to bed, uh, base at Habitat Mart, it's okay. And uh, we set up this project this way, real well. So, Academic Rock Team PRD pioneering in, with this uh, Antares mission, because in Brazil, uh, we don't identify uh, others uh, uh, projects uh, like us, né? academic rock teams uh, that they have a launch a launch base. Né? Oh, so, is a new bridge to uh, scientific education né? for this dissemination, this technology, academics, and uh, acknowledgements, and to. Uh, Dissemination space culture in Brazil, and so uh, be a normal. <laughs> everybody launching your uh, small rockets. Next slide. Uh, we have uh, some uh, pictures in here. Our launch, uh, launch pet, uh, uh, me with the rockets, the shallow. Vaquer espacial, <laughs> and uh, it, it's in a um, the shallow in a, um, in a trio of the 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 base. Next slide. <laughs> so, um, in that. The, these pictures is uh, there as uh, in above, not in, um, in the left, is the location they have touch marked. Uh, these pictures doing for uh, Ayrton, one on photographer in here in Brazil that help us with the drone, and uh, the center of the ima image is. Us do, uh, work in the base, uh, it's small. Then <laughs> uh, the right is the point of view of the observatories uh, to a uh, large pad. Next, please. Uh, this is pictures of the process and then not our pad mobile in still now but uh, we we pro progress to uh, launch a uh, pad one landing pad uh, a fix in this new uh, some a month uh, ago ago no <laughs> in 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 the future next please 
uh, this picture is very important to us uh, uh, because it's a picture of the uh, contract <laughs> consolidated. And we are uh, happy and uh, enthusiastic with the new uh, uh, partnership. And uh, uh, we expected a lot of this, a lot of projects and uh, the future bright. Next, please. Some of this, uh, these pictures is uh, results and dis discussions. Né? The uh, around of the 20 persons we uh, uh, go to that March to see us, to see the Shala uh, launching. If, uh, unfortunately, uh, this is uh, not possible, but uh, we know that normally in the situations of uh, rock, uh, rock the academic, rock the area, and uh, we we expected that the future, the entire school, that uh, is a is a future in in uh, when successfully. Can please. And well, uh, to finish questions, uh, as Luisa has presented, uh, these. Uh, these initiatives here in Brazil allowed us uh, how to, to think more about how would be the future uh, base and even that's on moon and Mars will be operating because we need to consider that we the, the main facility or the main structures for life support, but also uh, the astronauts future shadows will be there dealing with rocket trees, rockets, and uh, also need to have the idea about the safety, safety procedures. And with that, uh, with these uh, initiatives, these activities here, we, have, we can conduct some scientific findings and also have contributions for the development of space technologies. And at the same time, contributing for space exploration. Uh, some guidelines that we have presented here can be really motiva a motivating factor for students and uh, future professionals in the space sector and maybe allowing them to start to, to work in a company like SpaceX or, or Blue Origin or who knows. Well, uh, these are our contacts and the, the authors of, of this work. Thank you very much. For your attention, and you can follow us, Abitati Marti, and also the Portugal Rocket Designing in social media. Thank you.